Good morning. I'm here today at Lindo's Grocery Store in Warwick in Bermuda. So I'm here shopping for my first uh, cooking class that I'm going to be doing with my patients here in Bermuda on Thursday. So as a physician, I believe that food is medicine. We are what we eat. But teaching people to cook healthy food for themselves is a real key. And then realizing how it impacts their body. So today I'm picking up a few great things. So one of the things that I love that most people don't know much about is fennel or anais. So this actually can grow wild, but I love buying it here in Bermuda. It's got a licorice taste to it in the bottom. It can be, it's great in salads. So I'm gonna be putting that, I've already got that in my cart. The other thing that I've got is something called Christophene. So you may have never seen this before, but Christophene is kind of a blend between an apple and a cucumber. Absolutely delicious when eaten raw. Many people will cook it, but I find raw, it's a wonderful snack to have. And then what else have I picked up here in my cart? I've already been around the shop. So I've got some hemp hearts. So for many of you that are trying to get a lot of omega-3s in your diet, hemp hearts are a wonderful way. They're like a little sesame seed. You can top them to salads, you can add them into yogurt. Um, super great and delicious. Uh, today I also picked up some microgreens. So microgreens, these little guys are full of nutrients. They may be tiny, but they pack a lot of punch. As a vegetable grows from the seed, there's a lot of um, micronutrients just in that tiny little seed. And of course, as it's a big vegetable, that can nourish us as well. But microgreens are a super way to get micronutrients. I've also got some sugar snap peas. My cart's looking really green today, but we know green vegetables are super good for us as well. But also, I picked up a few things that people are often looking for some suggestions in the morning for what they can have with their breakfast cereal. And many cereals are really loaded down with a lot of sugar. But I love this, Keto and Company, it's a peanut butter crunch. So if you look at this in a, a half a cup serving, a quarter cup, you've got 11 grams of carbs with a lot of dietary fiber. So that's what you wanna start your morning with, is something that's higher in fiber, lower in sugar, because it's those sugar spikes that can give you cravings later on in the day. And another treat that I found here this morning at Lindo's is this Zevia mixer. So this is a ginger beer and it's flavored with stevia. So stevia is a great way to overcome your sugar cravings because it has zero calories and for most people it has no blood sugar response. So I've got lots of fun stuff here in my cart and I'm looking forward to the class that I'll be doing this week. Oh, I forgot to mention the other thing that I've got in here is a little bit of sour cream. So one of the options I'm gonna be making this week is a low carb, my quick and easy uh, little buns. They're my keto buns or my low carb buns. Um, I whip those up whenever I wanna have a little something instead of a heavy bread base. So I'll show you the video of that later on in this week as well after we do the cook cooking class. But I'm just really thankful to be here today um, and I'm happy to be at Lindo's. So Lindo's in Bermuda sponsors the Lindo's to Lindo's uh, walk. It was done just about a month and a half ago and they support the Diabetes Association here in Bermuda. And I'm really happy to team up with the Diabetes Association and that's where I'll be doing my cooking class later on in the week. And also the diabetes class will be joining me as we start the 14 day blood sugar challenge. So what's the 14 day challenge? So individuals will be wearing a Freestyle Libre, which is a um, continuous blood glucose monitor. It allows you to look at your body's response to the foods that you eat, the stress that you have, and the exercise that you do. So it's a patch that's worn just on your arm, and uh, it can be worn as part of my challenge. Anyone can do this. You don't need to be a diabetic. So if you want to sign up for the challenge, just look at the link above, and I'll have the details there. So it's going to be a live challenge every night at 7.30 on Zoom. And the great thing is you're going to be able to interact with local dietitians both here and in Bermuda. You're going to hear patient stories of how they've overcome diabetes and prediabetes by using the Freestyle Libre Monitor as one of their tools to help them to get engaged with what's going on in their body, to empower them to make those lifestyle choices and those changes. So I hope you're having a, a fun day on a Saturday doing some shopping. I'm going to pick up a few more things and then just head out. Again, I hope you'll continue to join me here. And again, if you want to join the free challenge starting Monday night at 730, look for the details above. Have a wonderful day. Thanks to Lindos for allowing me to come in today. And thanks for Bermuda Diabetes Association.